YZZ News at 9. It's another college scam, and this one involves the U of I. Some wealthy parents are taking advantage of a loophole that gives their children financial aid meant to help students in need. As Jamie Myers reports, the U of I says it's doing what it can to make sure this doesn't happen again. <laughs> These students are touring campus, some with big dreams of one day becoming an Illini. But there's a question on many of their minds. How are we going to afford this? There are other options. There's um, scholarships. But what about no longer being legally responsible for your kids? The U of I says last year it became aware of a pattern. Parents from wealthy areas in the Chicago suburbs were transferring legal guardianship of their children during their senior year of high school. That makes them eligible for significant need based grants they otherwise wouldn't be able to get. Wealthy families, I feel like they're gaming the system. You know, they're, they're working through a loophole. That's something Elizabeth Sotoropoulos says she's seen happen as an owner of Illini Tutoring. She says she's had families ask about falsifying things like their race or income to get more money for school. It teaches students that um, if you have money, you can, the rules don't apply to you. Sotoropoulos says it's not always about finances. Maintaining some family tradition of going to a certain school or just having a very impressive college name behind that child. And U of I says this type of behavior takes away from families who really need the help. That actually makes me kind of upset to know that you're kind of cheating the system. You have parents um, such as myself um, of a you know minority and, and lower income family that is working as hard as I am to make sure that he's getting what he needs. Well, dozens of Tazewell County children are showing off their 4-H projects tonight, presenting a year's worth of work. Kids 5 to 18 from different clubs around the county will have the opportunity to present their exhibits to judges. It teaches kids to get out of their comfort zone, to teach them public speaking skills, take on responsibilities, and take ownership in different things that they do and be proud of it. Exhibits include the swine and goat show, photography, and other various displays. Best of luck to them. Well, coming up on